Welcome back to MGS. What up, guys? This is the we the, have, the fun stuff. Yep, yeah, we have defeated the revolvers of ocelots. Wait, we punched him in the face, and now Liam is stuck on a door. Apparently, I meant to be able to get through a freshly unlocked door, which I would assume would be that one. You'd think. Nope, apparently not. Up. Uh, Hang on, let me let me look at this thing. It level four. Hang on, was it level four? I didn't yeah, if I can see it. Right there. Ah, okay, so it's a, a door I have to go back to. God fucking damn it! So I think you have to go through the hole that we made in the wall. Yeah, there we go. Hopefully, we don't have to go through that room with the auto turret. With the fucking C four. Yeah, unless we have to chaff the auto turret and fucking run. I don't know. Alright, so we gotta get out to where our... Oh, now there's people here. We did that one. Mm -hmm. That one was open. That was open. Oh, now, now that we're not jammed anymore, I can go talk to Meryl. Meryl. Fuck. Well, there's a bunch of stuff. Uh... Oh, is that... Is the red lines bad? I don't know. Let's find out. Select. So, farmers. Oh, yes, assault rifle. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Piece of shit. That is. Maybe uh, do I have to chaff that? Maybe. I'll give it a whirl. I'm sure we get picked up right out outside that boss fight. Mm. No, back where back here. That's fine with me. Okay. We need to get. Nope, in. it did not work. It did not work. Probably Move. kill him and run. <laughs> okay. Now, while I'm here. Yep. Um, I need one forty fifteen. Oops, wrong thing. Yep. Sorry, Mailing. I don't need you. You call Snake? Good luck, Snake. Thank you. 140.15. Hello? Who are you? I was really impressed with the way you busted yourself out of there. One from the prison? Uh huh. The what up? It me! <laughs> Yep. You think you're some kind of one man army? Nope. I don't need lectures. You're just like your uncle, you know? How do you know my uncle? We go way back. What's your name? My name's not important. Aha. Uh -huh. Could you be Snake? Yep. Are you Solid Snake? That's yeah, baby. You call me. The legendary Solid Snake? <laughs> you? Sorry about before. I wasn't sure if you were one of the good guys. But I knew you were. How? It's your eyes. My eyes. Ah, uh, some of this eyes. dialect. I mean, eyes, right? Dialogue. Yeah. Beautiful, compassionate eyes. Dear God. At least it sounds like they're building. He has a rep for being a bit of that kind yeah. of guy. The reality is no match for the legend, I'm afraid. Oh, I don't believe that. Why did you look so surprised when you saw my face? Because you look just like him. Liquid, yeah. Liquid snake? Yeah. You know him? Hmm? You're not brothers, are you? I have no family. So what's the deal then? Who knows? Why don't you ask him? I love how all video the game protagonists seem to sound the same. We're involved in this <laughs> well, the David Hayden is a bit... He's pretty iconic. Uh, I didn't ask for this. I have no family. <laughs> That's okay. Yennefer. Why is this place? I don't think it's just a nuclear weapons disposal facility. Boy, oh. Boy, it's just like them. Nobody told you anything, did they? Okay. You see, this place isn't really 
for disposing nuclear weapons. Yeah, we guessed that already, love. This is owned and operated by a dummy corporation of arms tech. This is a civilian base? Right. For the development of Metal Gear. Metal Gear. Colonel. Damn it! I just want, like, David Hayter as, as Snake to at one point, just when Metal Gear's back for this tenth time, just, fuck! <laughs> Why? Can I not get one fucking year? Oh, I'd love to see a Snake mental breakdown like that. Yeah. Where he just goes off the wall. It would be excellent. This was to be a final test before the formal adoption of the Metal Gear program. That's what I heard, anyway. Hey, do you know if David Hayter voices Geralt? I don't know. I'm gonna be unprofessional, let's be fun. Oh, fuck it. <laughs> the veneer was never there anyway. Re research is a, is a part of us. We do yep. it all the fucking time. Oh, we, there's like... Amazing, you were able to keep was it, um... It was one of the episodes of the Harry Potter series. Um... You met Baker, huh? How's he what? All I tell, like, I was listening to you and then I turn around to the line of dialogue, women have more hiding places than men. <laughs> Excellent. I turned around at the wrong moment. Uh, I tuned out at exactly the right moment. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, go on. <laughs> Whatever you were saying. Um, <laughs> something, something, something. Um, you've done research in episodes before, haven't you? Yes, yeah. definitely. Cool. So what's his name? David something? David Hayter. David Hasselhoff. Yeah. <laughs> uh, David Hayter, there we are. Second floor basement of the nuclear storage facility. Got it. To work on the nuclear launching program. So they'll need him alive until that's done anyway. Then we better do something before he finishes. You're right. In case we can't override the detonation code in time, I need to ask him how to destroy Metal Gear. You plan to take that thing on by yourself? Do you see reinforcements? The first time. What's the best way to get to the building where the doctor is being held? There's a cargo door on the first hmm. floor of this building that leads Okay, to so back to the first floor. The level of the door there? Five. But it's okay. I've got a level five oh, cool. Well, I've got to go save the doctor. You should go. I'm going with you. No way. You're still too green. I want you to hide somewhere. I'm not green. Oh, yes, you are. You pause for just See, look at the screen. Mm. You're green. <laughs> <laughs> Because you're a bitch. Ever since I was a little girl, I always dreamed about being Ah, this is this is where the operatic section yeah. comes in. <laughs> it's not like we're an hour into the game or anything. No, I don't need. Oh, he did voice acting in Super Smash Bros. Because Snake's in it. Yeah, of course he did. They wouldn't get anyone else to do it. Everybody feels sick the first time they kill someone. Unfortunately, killing is one of those things that gets easier the more you do it. In a war, all of mankind's worst emotions, worst traits come out. It's easy to forget what a sin is in the middle of a battlefield. But this isn't a war. It's a terrorist action. You're just a little jumpy from the combat high. The adrenaline in your bloodstream is starting to thin out. Just take it easy. But I learned all about combat high at the academy. We'll talk about it later. For now, just think about keeping yourself alive. If I get out of here alive, I'll think about that other stuff. Okay. Let me try to say this another way. Stay the hell out of my way. <laughs> You're a real bastard. Ding! Like my uncle said. That is the only way to do it. I don't see why that's funny. I'll be a good girl. We'll link up after I grab the doctor. Then we'll take care of the detonation code override. Oh, yeah, gotcha. okay. But listen, I know this area better than you. Call me if you have any questions. Be careful, okay? Good to know. After I open up the cargo door, I'll contact you. Alright, okay. Now that's done, we can actually get to the episode proper. Woo! About time. Anyway, I finished my research. Yeah? Um... So obviously, he's done all the Metal Gear games, but he's also done Star Wars and the Old Republic. Oh, um, Super Smash Bros. Obviously, Bloodstained Ritual of the Night. Really? 
Yep. He played Zangetsu. Oh. Deponia Doomsday, Dragon Age Inquisition, uh, Republic. You remember that? Republic? Episode? Yeah, the episodic game. Very vaguely. Yeah. <laughs> Yahtzee Croshaw did a review of it and he was just like, it's a piece of shit. Meryl, what? <laughs> I'm talking loudly on a communications device. Booty! <laughs> That's all it means. God damn it! <laughs> In baby, <laughs> this dialogue, man. Ah. Sorry, but this, this is the only way I can figure out whether or not I'm cut out to be a soldier. I gotta get my hands dirty. These guys are professionals. You're gonna get yourself killed. Oh, he was also in the long dark. Really, Jeremiah. Fuck. All right, so that big ass door. I think it's yeah. the bottom. Gotta love that late '90s dialogue, though. Yeah. You said you'd stay put and be a good girl. Just, just, just get it over and done with and bang already. Jesus Christ. No, I don't care if you're in the middle of enemy territory. Just... Just fuck just already. Just fuck already. Exactly. Oop. Yep. Oop. What's that? <laughs> you were too bottle. enthusiastic. It's fine. Drink bottle. There we go. Wilder. Alright, where's that cargo door? So there's a guy in there. Okay. Got him! Now you have a suppressor. I have a suppressor! And a ration. Booyah! <laughs> Bitch! Oh, there's Here's a the gas. What? Okay, that's no good. I never got shit to help. I'd say well, that's a I'd say that's a fail state. I need a gas um, mask. Or oh, do I need to throw a chaff grenade? Maybe. Do I need to disable? Well, let's check this first. Yep. Maybe she'll tell me. Good to know. Excellent. Chaff? Maybe. <laughs> what? Maybe you need two? Or to get closer? Or do I have to be closer to the first sensor? Mm. Well, time to die. Yep. Wee! Now it didn't hit those ones. Ugh. Might need but to... the chest work? Do I need to wait a minute? Uh, maybe, yeah, maybe wait. Mm. There we go, now it's working. But the chest of... Mm. Do I need to use both of them? Possibly. I'm be so annoyed. <laughs> Unless you need to stand a little further back so it lands like in the middle and then goes up. But then it wasn't hitting the ones at the back. Hold on, I've... let me try. <laughs> yeah, go, go, F fuck it, fuck it. Got any tips, if asshole? Any questions about weapons or equipment? You should ask our military analyst, Nastasha. Ah. Uh. Is one four one point five two. A pleasure to work with you, Solid Snake. You're the nuclear specialist. So we're just figuring some stuff out. Terrible European accent. Okay.
Hang on a minute. Mm -hmm. The world cannot stand by idly and allow that to happen. Idea. Infrared mm. sensors. Can I use the cigarettes? Maybe. To at least see like the beams or something. Oh. They're the beams. Yeah. So I guess you have to walk through them. You need, you need the cigarettes equipped so you can actually see the beam, by the looks of it. We figured it out, it's fine. No, nope. it was still there. Yeah, you need to wait for it to go up. Yeah, we have to go up? Yeah. <sighs> Alright, so. Got now, through that. Now we can stop draining our, our health so that we can see where the uh, infrared lasers are. Yay! You'd think that our... Our friend, what's her name? Booty. Booty. Yeah. Booty. Yeah. I think I think we we just found out her name's Meryl. Oh, okay. Meryl. Meryl. What you want? Snake, be careful. There are claymore mines around here. Use a mine detector. Who are you? Just call me. Ah. <laughs> 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 oh. That's 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 golden. That's a name, all right. <laughs> Deep throat. Mm. He should um he should take a trip to Warsaw. As uh, I'm sure there's a landmark that he would find very um satisfying. <laughs> Ow. So where do you get a mine detector? I have no idea. And this would appear to be. Big tank boy? Hello! Oh, it has machine guns on the top. Oh, hi. Hey. That's threatening. Cool. Because that makes sense. Vulcan Raven. You should crawl on the ground like the snake you are. I. This is really threatening. Mm hmm. Damn it. Fucking claim Good start. Good start. Oh dear. Ow! He shot me! The plate is mined? Well, if you use a mine detector, you'll be able to see the mines displayed on your radar. If you need a mine detector, second floor of the tank hangar. Second floor of the tank hangar. Alright. Alright, okay, let's backtrack a little bit. Then I have to go through that stupid room again. Hmm. Ah, uh, yes, cardboard box. Mine detector. detector! Fecking sweet. And I'm a probably... ration. What health am I on now? You're about half. May as well use it. Yep. Do I have to go and get the mine detector again? Hope not. Oh. Okay, we're back. So, we've got uh, the mine detector. Yeah. I'm not sure what Liam's going to leave in for the cut for this. So basically, <laughs> not much. The, the moral of the story is uh, we had to get a mine detector because this area is mined. That bit you probably know. So we, fi we found the mine detector. And now we're... Um, yeah, it was... It was quite the effort to actually um, find it. Yeah. Because we died so many times in that room with the poison gas. And then we died oh, once because a soldier found us and killed us. Ah, yes, the famous backwards shuffle. Nailed it. <laughs> <laughs> and there, so there's five of them. Yeah. 
And so I'll grab and get the other one. Yeah, grab the other one. And also that is That's a ration home. Yeah. yeah. Ah, yes, the backwards shuffle. Just in case crawling directly on top of it does things. Yeah. So what do I, I this is the tank thing, so yeah. I'm gonna throw throw down with some grenades. Have we picked up the claymores? Are they in our weapon set now? Yeah, but they're mines to set. I gotta get oh, close okay. to this thing. Maybe can I stun it? Like a chap or something? I don't know, it is a tank. We'll just go through the cutscene again and then we'll get started. Well I know I can see the cutscene. I think you need to use the claymore. Oh, aha. Mm. That M1 tank is equipped with advanced electronics. Once it locks onto a target, it automatically tracks it. And its main gun is effective. Three thousand? Yep. To get close, you'll have to confuse the tracking system. Use your chaff. If you can jam mm. the all right, so chaff and then run in. Mm hmm. And then you'll have to use the claymores in the other mines. <laughs> you just chaffed yourself. Where is it? Ah! No, oh, grenades do work. To work. Ow. Fuck. Oh, there's another. There's another box you could grab there. Ow, 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 ow. Ooh, more grenades. Ah, hey. oh, so they had the same idea as you. <laughs> we might want to be prepared to ration soon. And don't get run over. <laughs> what did I just say? <laughs> <laughs> yes, the ultimate defense. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, you'll have to get a chaff up soon. Oh, no, there it is. It's fine. It's alright. <laughs> I've got to be able to land, land a grenade on it. Yeah. And you need to get up and run. Need. <laughs> Fucker. <laughs> Oh dear god. You'd think spending more time under the tank would do more damage. I hit it. Not bad. And there's another box of nades you can use huh? as well. Okay. That's what I wanted. Oh, there's two boxes of nades. Bam! Got him! Take that, bitch! <laughs> An accurate representation of what would happen if you dropped a grenade in a on tank. a tank. <laughs> I mean, obviously, if you are uh, in the first... <laughs> In the first instance, we're able to get a grenade inside a tank. You yeah. only need the one grenade. But, you know, pretty good. Pretty good. Keycard. Oh, yeah. What was another... Ten... More cards, more problem. What was another boss fight? Do I get another level up? Hopefully. We're being toyed with. We are. What did you think of him? He is just as you hmm? said. Were we really? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Running around. <laughs> no, like we got run over by a tank about five times. Ugh. I will kill you. So, General Ivan, I hear you took your hand as well as your dignity. Ivan? Mm. Is that the name of um, Revolver? I don't know. Ite? Oh, what? Come on, man. 
<laughs> this game's gone on long enough. <laughs> Ew, spooky. Alright. Everyone has weird attachments to animals. Mm-hmm. I was hoping I could stay out there a little bit longer because they had more grenades out there. Oh, hey, we got an upgrade. Yeah. I'll take that. Alright, so I'll do a hearty save here. Yeah. I think we've got a little bit more time to kill, so... Oh, yeah. So we can push on. Yeah. Just for a tad more. Alright, I can do that. What can I do for you, Snake? Save the fucking game! The thing that you're for. <laughs> <laughs> do your thing, oh woman of saving the game. The nuke blitz. <laughs> <laughs> ah, yes. That famous article of defense. Don't piss off the people that are gonna kill you? Mm. Well, the fact that you're saying that now makes me want to put the mind detector on. <laughs> yep. You know, just in case. Alright, so there's a down section and a here. Another ration. Oh, so we get more rations now. Uh... Yeah, we can have one more. Oh, uh, yeah. And have full health, which is handy. Mm. There was a button we could push on that thing. Was there? Yeah. Because we got the level 3 card. Mm. But that was an actionable, an actionable bit. Action. I don't think so. What the fuck is that glowing thing then? I think it's just flavor. Uh, might have just been the screen wigging out as well. It might have been. All right, what we got? It is an actionable button. It was not actionable. Uh, crawl under it? Maybe. Do 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 do. What do you want? Be careful. You absolutely must not use weapons in that area. I've already programmed the nanomachine so that he won't be able to, Colonel. What? What are you talking about? Have you forgotten? That's where they keep the nuclear warheads. How you see Time for some nades! Oh yeah! Boom! <laughs> So we need to get up to the second floor to get to uh, Hal, Dr. Uh, Amelie. Cool. Nastasha. Nastasha. I've forgotten her last name already. It's not Romanov by chance. So I can't use weapons in here. Mm. No use. Chefs! Could we have a knife? That's a big ass camera over there. Mmm. Oh, no, no. oh, the grates make noise. They have weapons in here! Ow! Oh, oh and gas. poison gas. And gas. Ah, oh, good to good know. Start. Well, this is a fucking terrible room. Can you crawl under the door and hide, or...? They, they would have shut it off because of the gas. Uh. It's strange that in a stealth game you don't have a stealth melee weapon. Hmm. I guess that was one of... One of the inventions that didn't come with, um... Hideo Kojima's innovations. Oh, and the gas. I got it. I got through. And I gotta get up those stairs. Yeah. There's some pharma bullets. Ow. Bitch. They're really bad Bitch. shots. That was the sound your mom makes. Ha! <laughs> got he. Oh, <laughs> the moment! Wait, can you use the cardboard box? 
I don't know how it's going to help, but... Like, in future. Obviously not now, because they can see you, but... It is just a box. Move on, please. <laughs> Audio <laughs> man! That's <laughs> fine! He moved on! Oh! He goes this way? Mm-hmm. That might be our ticket. Go. Level 3 cut. Good. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, you bitch. Nice. Alright, where are we going? Um, B1 or B2? B B1. Suck oh. in! <laughs> that was oh. too much effort. That was horrible. Oh. Alright, I think let's do a hearty save and then we're done. Yep, alright. Meryl! No, Mei Ling! Mei Ling! Please save me. Literally. Give us that fat save. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Alright. I, I want that fat save. That's it for this episode. Oh. Are we guys playing Bleach? <laughs> <laughs> it was easy. Yeah. Well, for the most part. Yeah. <laughs> Remember those last couple of sessions? Uh, <laughs> okay. Well, oh, yeah. we'll but see you guys next it time. It's way easier to do bants over Bleach. That's very true. so bad. There's less, there's less tension here. Yep. Oh. But fuck me. <laughs> Stop trying to bang your co-workers. That never ends well. Alright, we'll catch you guys next time, where we will meet one of the best characters in the whole franchise. But <laughs> three whole episodes. You got three whole episodes. Damn it. Without a doubt.